Welcome, plungers. Well, I've been playing Ark. That's Ark right. Ascended, to be exact. And if you've been here for a while, you know that any game that gives me the opportunity to build, boy, I'm going to build. And I've been building. So it all started with this structure right here. This was everything. This is where my bed was. This is where my, like, everything. Have a seat, Phil. Everything was here. That's right. Phil. Sit down. That's right. Yeah, everything was in here. I had my generator, my right. cryo fridge. Um, I had oh, industrial cooker forges. Back here was my storage. Um, I had a refrigerator, my smithy, my fabricator. They were all in here. And then I outgrew this place. So this was the next place that I built. And this is the carnivore habitat. So I built this next. And it wasn't only the carnivore habitat. I had a mixture of dinos in here. Oh, goodness. And I also... Is that a cat? That's right. That's an Istiosaurus, whatever it's called. And he really did this at the, at the wrong possible base. Like, this is now, now I'm, I'm stuck now. I'm stuck. Oh. This guy's got to just move out of my way. Just move out of my way. Let me back in here, please. Come on. You turn around and get your butt back in here. That's right. So I can close the door. And which one of y'all got the That's right. the thing off the it 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 it's 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 theosonus? Like I got I I gotta learn how to pronounce these words. I gotta learn words again. How to pronounce those things. But that's one thing I don't like. I don't like with the heads are sticking out of the door. Yo, Pedro. Have a seat, buddy. Come on. Pedro's OG. He's my first Pterodon, Pteranodon. I don't take them out for any reason at all. I'm lying. He's very fast. We go places often, but I don't fight with him. I avoid it. Because he's OG, I try to... I want to keep him as long as possible. So, I avoid fighting with him. Now, Phil, on the other hand, is also OG. He's my first. I'm just scratching his RG. And I fight with him all the time. Like, that's how he got leveled up so quickly. But yeah. Oh, wait, I didn't show you this part real quick. Up here, yeah, I built like a little office or something up here. Its main purpose is to give me access to the roof. But this is my security weak point right here. I have to build something here. That, oh no, not really. Yeah, there it is. That room is a security weak point. So if I put anything in that room, it's compromised. But yeah, there's a door there. And yeah. But moving right along, let's go check out the armory. This right here is nothing here other than access to the bay in this direction. And I have one over here giving access to the bay in this direction and I have that little dock and that structure over there in the distance is what I'm ultimately going to throw onto the boat when I build the boat but I don't want to just get the boat I want a speedboat so when I get the speedboat then I will build that structure onto the speedboat unless I decide at that point to make the structure out of metal but who knows but this is the armory now through this door is access to again this part of the bay and to the other wing which is the herbivore wing this is direct access to the herbivore wing and we'll come back to that in a moment and uh this is access to the backyard which is where the brontosaurus lives and this is don sarko the brontosaurus's personal personal bodyguard 
There's my Dodicarus. We're gonna get to him in a moment. Let's close up these doors and show you the armory real quick, which isn't quite complete. I built this place in essence to house my industrial forge. It was gonna pop in there, but I've grown since then and I haven't even built an industrial forge yet. So the industrial forge is gonna go into the next build. But yeah, this is where I keep my tributes. Uh, this is where my weapons, my saddles, armors. Uh, oh, wait a minute. I got a sniper rifle in there. Got that from a drop. There's a lot of stuff that I have in here that I just straight from drops. Like, scan real quick if you can see any ascendant stuff like uh, this. Wink, wink. Um, yeah, but a lot of stuff in here. And we go through another set of doors to come to the roof here. And as you can see, there is the rooftop access here. Because this is where I had Pedro. That was Pedro's parking spot at one point. Even though I do have access in there, everything was in there. But I did have ac roof access. And But nah, this was Pedro's spot. Pedro was my first team, actually, this game. Not even first wing creature was first tame. I just skipped right past the Parasaur and went straight to Pedro. So, I got my Stegosaurus that needs a name. Maybe you can help name her in the comments. But, yeah, it's my Wood Gatherer. And these are second generation for some RGs upstairs that have been getting it on. We've got Monica and we got Rafer been up here just cranking out kids. In fact, there's another one that still attached to her butt. We're going to get to that, and we're going to get to that, too. We're getting up there. We're getting up there, because I have been building. Built that wall. We're going to build a platform on top of this guy. I just want to get his... Uh, I want to get him to at least 30,000 HP. But, yeah. So, let's go over here. At some point, there's a gap here because at some point I'm going to build something going around this. And I think maybe it's just, I don't know. I don't know if it's a platform that's going to go all the way to, to the top because that seems redundant at this point. So I'll probably just make a platform here that also connects to that little island that will probably also connect to the wall. So I will enclose this entire thing at some, that's the goal for this to enclose the entire thing and have this little entrance right there is the the waterway in to the base and have that little little thing here is like a, my own personal lagoon so we'll close everything off and I tried I'm I'm still working on making a structure under here to make it look like it's structurally sound, like it's not just balancing on one beam and you know, everything is just sitting on top of one thing. So yeah, some support structure is coming. And uh, yeah, this is, I have no idea what this is gonna be. Not yet, but it's where my bed is. The new location of my bed. I've been known to uh, snipe creatures off of the beach here this guy oh something got hit something got hit oh something else got hit something got hit yeah you going a little crazy over there Uh-oh. I gotta take them out now. Because they're gonna cause all kinds of problems. At least torpor run. Yeah. They're just gonna cause problems now. But yeah, that was it. If I had a parachute, I would definitely jump down. I wonder if I'll die if I jump down. So I'll probably hit the water. Hopefully hit the water. No! Ugh. But yeah. That's my base, guys. 
Thanks for tapping in. Peace. <laughs> With your broke ass. <laughs>